First thing you know, TxDOT says the final design of the new Harbor Bridge is, quote, highly problematic. They've released the findings from an independent engineering service, so we now know what some of the problems are. From this point on, we need complete transparency in what's going on. International Bridge Technologies took a look at the design of the new Harbor Bridge and found five primary safety concerns. The one that stands out is that deficiencies in footing caps leads them to believe a bridge collapse is possible under certain load conditions. In the letter issued by TxDOT, they stated the other issues relate to delta frames. They say if construction continues with the current delta frames, issues will be exacerbated. If we're talking about a bridge collapse, let's find out a timeline to fix it and let's find out what happened and let's make sure the public now feels safe because that bridge now, everybody's going to watch it. TxDOT also says Flat Iron Dragados and the engineer don't believe there are any design flaws. After learning about this, State Representative Todd Hunter is after transparency from TxDOT. The details need to all be put out there. It's taxpayer public money. They deserve it. And so I think transparency and the push for information is the key right now. Hunter assured that any overrun costs from this halt in work will not be placed on local governments. We reached out to TxDOT for an interview, but they declined. Hunter says going forward, he's going to demand an update from TxDOT every two weeks, and he'll relay what he learns to the public. As for Chris Six, we're doing our own digging, submitting open records requests for several documents, but those requests have not been filled just yet. Reporting in Corpus Christi, Iran Hammy, Chris Six News.